Today's video is sponsored by Sheet Music Plus, a great website with sheet music from any genre you could possibly want. Click the link down in the description below and enter in the word love at checkout and you get $15 off your order. How about that? In the meantime, stick around. We got a great video coming for you. Welcome to Room 6, a channel dedicated to the local Las Vegas music scene and the people that make it, including me. I'm Josh, and today we're taking a look at a great option to performing live in this weird time we find ourselves in. Being a session musician has a long history and can even open up some doors you wouldn't normally have uh, found. They may not get all the applause, but a lot of your favorite music wouldn't exist without them. If you're enjoying the content Room 6 is putting up, please make sure you subscribe down there and hit the bell so you don't miss an episode. While you're at it, feel free to like and share, and uh, yeah, let's go. Let's start off with a disclaimer. I am not now, nor have I ever, been a session musician. It's a sector of the music world I've always been interested in, but never got the chance to pursue. Being a session musician has always been attractive to me, in much the same way that being a Jedi SURPRISE LIGHTSABER or a professional dancer or some other lofty career goal might interest many of you. We recognize the high level of mastery needed to attain that rarefied air and no, we'll never get there. But, we can always dream. Dreamweaver. But let's suppose for a second that you are that good at your craft. Uh, suppose you've established a bit of a reputation around town as a master of your instrument, and people generally love having you on stage. Being a session musician, maybe just what you need during these covid inflicted times to pay the bills in some ways the session artist is the unsung hero of popular music being generally a short-term gig you're there to play your part get paid and get going to the next gig you'll get credit in the liner notes and maybe be asked to go on tour some session musicians are actually on the studio or label payroll, providing their services whenever needed, and often being asked to perform multiple genres within a short amount of time. They might also work on commercial jingles and TV or film. Remember when I mentioned the unsung hero thing? Session artist is the unsung hero, unsung hero, unsung hero. goes double when a band needs a last minute replacement or an album needs to be finished right now. Session musicians are expected to be professional and ready at the drop of a hat. But what about the pay I hear you say? Um, no. Quite a few session musicians are part of some union with set rates of pay in exchange for future rights to royalties. Our freelance artists, on the other hand, can ask whatever they want based on their reputation, ability to perform, and other factors. As an example, in 2020, the American Federation of Musicians listed a rate of $868.42 for three hours of basic non-symphonic sound recording and $1,302.64 for three hours of premium non-symphonic recording. Whatever that is. Being a session musician can be lucrative and fun if you have the chops and the right temperament. It can even lead to something bigger. Well-known acts include the likes of Billy Preston, Carol Kay, The Wrecking Crew, Booker T and the MGs, The Funk Brothers, 
Chet Atkins, and even the Hollywood Studio Symphony. If this sounds good to you, now's the time to start practicing like never before. If you think you're ready to enhance someone's musical vision, record yourself and put it out there. Who knows, you may become the next secret in music production. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed and you found it somewhat educational. In the meantime, if you want to see more videos like this, click up here. If you'd like to subscribe, please click down here and don't forget to ring the bell. Remember to be amazing, stay safe, stay strong, and we'll see you next time on Room 6.